Welcome back, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for taking the time to spend a little time with me. I normally don't do this, but guys have been asking for me to do it. They want to hear my opinion on the trail and things like that. So I'm going to do somewhat of a breakdown analysis and look at some of the things from a simulation standpoint. So let's take a look at it, guys. So the first and foremost, look at Todd Gurley right here. I want you to pay attention to how he finishes this stiff arm and this interaction. These are the type of things I want you guys to look for when you actually have a chance to play the game. All right. Also right here, this is Pac-Man Jones. He's going to go into, look at that hurdle. Look at how that hurdle doesn't look like the normal hurdle from the past. Also right here, I just want to show you again, you know, the juke move. And we've seen this in the prior trailer. But this right here as well. Take a look at this. We're going to rewind this and come back and take a look at it. I want you to look at the deflection. Look at the way the ball travels due to the ball physics. Look at the interaction all the way to the ground. As well as, you know, the coach right now is reacting to the play. But just look at all of that, how the physics right there plays out. Good stuff right there. Look at the different spin right here, guys. It's more of a, a, a tight spin, if you will. Ezekiel Elliott right here got a lean going on right there, and he's getting skinny. Also right here for you presentation guys, you know, you're going to see, you know, different cleats and things of that nature. Just little stuff like that, man. All right. Now let's take a look at this as well. Another stiff arm from Doug Martin. But look at how his hand is. It's like he's punching the guy. You know, and like I said, some of these things we may have seen before, but it's all about how clean this game will play. That's something that we still need to see. But like I said, you know, I'm doing this from a simulation standpoint. Guys have been asking me to do it. And these are the things, man, that I want you to take notice to once you have the opportunity to see this game up close and personal. Look at this interaction right here. Look at the SWAT, right? Knock the ball out. Boom. Other guy comes in. Physics plays out. His physics is still playing out against uh, Rebus right there. You know, just little stuff like that. Another little uh, moment right there when Antonio Brown was getting skinny. Look at Patrick Peterson. Look at this interaction all the way through, how he knocks the ball out. All right, and we'll finish out with this, guys, right here. I want you to take a look at uh, Ward and how he actually makes contact with the ball. Now, of course, you know, we could always debate, you know, is he able to come off clean like that off the edge? Uh, I mean, looking at the tight end, I'm assuming that's who that is. He's got to make a decision there. So, of course, we can always give feedback on that, you know, depending on the situation. To me, I understand why he came in clean like that, just like you would see in these type of situations. But, you know, that's something to keep an eye on. But look at that ball. You notice there's really not any force feel right there. You're going to see it again, I believe, from this angle. But look at how the ball actually hits Ward's arm. And that's very important. All right, guys? So that's pretty much going to do it, man. But like I said, I just wanted to get this out because guys were asking for me to do this. Pointed out some of these little things that, you know, us in the simulation community would love to see and like to see in our football products. So these are the things I want you to look out for when the game drops. All right? So leave your thoughts. Leave your comments. Hit that like button. See you next time. Peace. Once again, guys, thanks for coming by. And if you want to interact with me live, head on over to Sim Standard Radio every Thursday night at 8 p.m. Eastern, along with Smitty and Azure Fact. The call-in number for the show is down in the description. Now, of course, for more content, go ahead and click the link above. And before you go, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. All right, guys, until next time, lights out.